We have seen people who are quite curious when they've come across the word iridology and they've often asked the question, where did iridology stem from? Where does it come from? Well, the story goes that it comes, it's about 300 years old and it was discovered uh, in Hungary. And to cut a long story short, it was to do with an owl breaking its leg and a young Hungarian that actually looked at the eyes out and he found a marking at six o'clock in the eyes of the owl. And that marking indicated that the owl had broken his leg. And the amazing part is that when he, when he, when he, when he helped to restore the owl's leg back to normal, after a few weeks, after a few months, the mark in the eye disappeared. And he was intrigued by that. So he was an intelligent young man so he went across to all the hospitals and met to all the doctors and he'd say, what does this patient suffer from? And he'd say, liver. So he'd look, he would look at marking in the eye and he'd see the marking at eight o'clock in the right eye, for example. And he would mark every organ that, he, did his, that the doctor was saying was wrong. He would look at it and he'd see a particular marking in the eye. And from there, many, many doctors, actual doctors, took this science on and studied it and pushed it forward. So much so that one particular doctor, Dr. Bernard Jensen, was a medical doctor, a top chiropractor, a nutritionist, and a world traveler. And Bernard Jensen is reputed to have seen 700,000 patients in his clinic in California. 700,000. So that's a very clever man. And I studied all the information from him about all his books, and I even met people that were connected with him as family. And it, it, I was fascinated by how much this man had acquired. He went around the world 28 times to us to study nutrition and longevity. And he used iridology uh, during that time. So he was one of the pioneers in California and the USA. And he's revered by people who understand the science of iridology. So that's where it comes from. Now I'm convinced that it works because I'm highly intelligent about logical things. My dad was an engineer. I've got an engineering mind. And I found out there's a scientific proof that every single day, 28,000 signals comes from your spinal column and goes to the optic nerve and marks your eyes. Every single day, your eyes are changing. Your iris is changing. You see it, right? So then I can look at, the, I took a photograph of the iris and I can read the eyes, and I use a chart for that, which I'll explain in another video. And before you know it, you'll get an amazing analysis of what's happening inside your body, and it can prevent a lot of major problems occurring later. We can see what could happen, what may happen with particular liver, kidneys, lungs, whatever, and brain even. We can see that, and we can warn you, you should be, shouldn't be drinking this, you shouldn't be doing that, follow the advice and get the results you deserve, okay? Now, since you're here, I've written this book, all right? It took a long time to write it, it's an e-book. It says, How Your Eyes Can Reveal Your Health. It's a fascinating read. I spent three to four months, day after day after day, gleaning the information to write in that booklet. I suggest you subscribe to it now before something intervenes. Get the book, read about it, right? And give us a feedback of what you think. And by all means, ask us for a Zoom call. We can talk more about it and you'll learn a lot more about iris, iridology and what it can do for your health. Thank you.